We definitely lost a bit of momentum. David and I, you know, we lost our wickets uh, fairly closely, and you know, AB de Villiers departed soon after that. Um, it gave an opportunity for 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 Mangi to show us what he has, and you know, he definitely delivered in the last over there. Uh, normally, by 160 is a, is about par at, uh, at Newlands in day night games, and you know, we got 170 or 169, which was a little bit above par we thought. And we were playing four seamers, you know, in the night time, the ball tends to skid on just a little bit more, and. Um, you know, I think we batted really well. We reassessed from the Wanderers game. We, uh, you know, AB held the innings together nicely. Reza oh. Hendricks batted really nicely, and we thought we got a good score. It complicated things quite a lot. You know, uh, he's been our star bowler in the first two T20 internationals, and had to find a couple of overs uh, um, to fulfil his quota. I was toying with bowling myself or John John. Um, we thought maybe the nature of the wicket. Maybe spin wasn't a bad uh, option, you know, with hitting the ball into the wind for the left-hander. Uh, he's a tried and tested bowler at franchise level. Uh, but he was a massive loss for us, you know. He, uh, uh, he's a strike bowler who seems to get wickets, you know, when called upon. And, uh, yeah, that was, that, that was a tough blow for us tonight. Yeah, it was very frustrating. Um, something that you can't really prepare for, you know. We... You know, we, we, we let ourselves down in the field, gave them the momentum and took the momentum away from our bowlers. I can't put it down to any sort of reason, it's just one of those nights. We fielded superbly the last couple of months. Um, guys have put in the effort. Maybe just the occasion for one or two younger players um, in one of their first internationals. Maybe just a, big, a bit too big for them this evening, but hopefully they'd have learned from that. Um, but look, there are a lot of passes to take. Um, obviously, you never want to be losing these type of series, so that's the disappointment. But there's some good performances from some individuals. Some guys have put their hand up, and probably some guys haven't put their hand up. So uh, the absolute benefits to uh, this particular series massively. For sure, we've got uh, an established, settled T20 side. Um, uh, but it's great to have that sort of competition, and, and some guys are really putting some good performances. Some guys maybe haven't done as well as we would have hoped for. Absolutely, he's, uh, he's one of the best batters in the world and great to have him back. So um, good to see him finding a little bit of form and looking fresh and hungry and that's, that bodes well for the rest of our summer. These games gave us um, some more, uh, a little bit more clarity and uh, a little bit more um, ideas to the type of makeup of the side we want to be having. Um, the all-rounders we're looking, look our top six is probably pretty established. It's trying to find the new ball bowling partners, trying to find the all-rounders at seven and eight. Um, so hopefully these next couple of weeks will give us a bit more clarity on that. We've got, we've got an understanding, but hopefully those particular spots can give us a little bit more clarity going forward now.